And hi everyone, welcome back to the Dr. Phone channel. So Dr. Phone Data Recovery is a recovery solution designed to help users recover their different types of accidentally deleted files from different devices. And today we're actually going to talk about something so common that the majority of people encounter in their daily life. And yes, we are going to be talking about accidentally deleting a few important WhatsApp messages and then trying to look for ways to recover them. So believe it or not, accidentally losing WhatsApp conversations is actually way more common than a lot of people might expect, and it can happen due to a wide variety of different reasons. But fortunately, tools like Dr. Phone Data Recovery are going to be here to retrieve such lost messages and restore them back on your smartphone. So in today's video, we're going to talk about exactly how to go step-by-step -step into recovering your deleted WhatsApp messages using Dr. Phone Data Recovery on both Android and iOS devices. So if you've been looking for an effective way to restore deleted WhatsApp messages, then go ahead and keep watching. This video will help you get the job done just as intended, and it's only going to take a few minutes. Uh, but before that, why don't you just go ahead and subscribe to this channel to make sure that you stay up to date with every tutorial that is going to be coming up that is just very likely to impact your life in a positive way. So let's go ahead and dive right in. Now, before we talk about the recovery methods in order to get your deleted WhatsApp messages back, let's first introduce you to our data recovery solution and that is going to be dr phone data recovery which is going to be a cross-platform recovery tool that you can use to retrieve accidentally deleted or let's say lost files from both android and ios devices in the case of android devices however you can use dr phone data recovery to recover files from both built-in storage as well as the external sd card if need be so apart from your regular whatsapp conversations you will also be able to recover other types of deleted files from your Android device. So as of now, Dr. Phone Data Recovery is compatible with almost every Android version, which means that you'll be able to retrieve files irrespective of the smartphone brand that you are using right now. So like it doesn't really matter for the most part what kind of version of Android you're using. So let's just quickly walk you through the step-by-step -step procedure of recovering deleted WhatsApp messages on an Android device using Dr. Phone Data Recovery. So first things first, as per usual, go ahead and install then launch Dr. Phone Data Recovery on your computer and then configure the tool and select data recovery on its home screen to get started from there. And then go ahead and connect your Android device to your computer using a USB cable and just wait for it to get recognized at last. After Dr. Phone recognizes your device, you can now choose the location from where the messages were deleted in the left side menu. And then just go ahead on the right side of the screen and select the data type that you want to recover. And since we want to restore WhatsApp messages, go ahead and select the WhatsApp messages and attachment option, and then click the next button. On the next screen, go ahead and click on the scan for deleted files option, and then click on next. And then for step number five, Dr. Phone will now just start scanning the selected storage drive in order to fetch out all the deleted WhatsApp conversations and display them on your list when finally done. Once the process finally completes, just go ahead and select the messages uh, that you want to get back and then click on restore to device onto your Android device promptly. And that's how to recover deleted WhatsApp messages on Android using Dr. Phone Data Recovery. And now just like on an Android device, you can also use Dr. Phone in order to recover your deleted WhatsApp messages on an iPhone. So when it comes to an iOS device, you can use Dr. Phone to retrieve your deleted data from let's say an iCloud account or iTunes backup as well as the phone storage. In every situation, the tool will help you recover deleted WhatsApp messages without any kind of hassle. So let's first check out how to recover deleted WhatsApp messages from an iCloud backup as many people actually have a habit of backing up their WhatsApp data through their iCloud service, which is totally fine. It's totally cool to go in that direction too. So step one, go ahead and launch Dr. Phone Data Recovery on your computer and then select Data Recovery from the home screen menu in order to get started from here. And then connect your iPhone or iPad, whatever device you're using, to your computer and then, then select Recover iOS Data to proceed further from here. On the left menu bar, go ahead and select the Recover from iCloud synced files and then sign in with your iCloud credentials as per usual. So Dr. Phone from here will just automatically scan your iCloud backup file and then ask you to select the data that you want to get back. 
And so you can go ahead and just scan through it or skim through it and look for the files that you want to recover back. And then once you have selected the right data types, you know, go ahead and click on next from there. And at this point, the tool will just start downloading the backup file back to your device as per usual. So be patient as this process may actually take a little bit to complete. And after the backup file is finally successfully downloaded, you'll be able to access all of its content on your screen. And I'll go through these results and then select the messages that you want to restore. And finally, click on restore to device at the very bottom right corner to complete the process from here. And that's going to be how to recover your deleted WhatsApp messages on an iPhone or iPad when you have an iCloud backup. And now it's worth noting that not all iPhone users have a habit of configuring the iCloud backup on, on their devices when it comes to WhatsApp or anything like that. Instead, they just prefer to go with a more local method of using iTunes instead which does work across so many different types of, of devices too. And if that's the case, you can also use iTunes backup in order to recover your deleted messages on your iPhone. It'll be a pretty much similar process with a few minor changes. So yeah, just bear with me on this one. So step one is going to be to once more go ahead and launch Dr. Phone Data Recovery and select Data Recovery from the home screen and then connect your iDevice and click on Recover iOS Data from there. So this time, go ahead and select the recover from iTunes backup file, which is going to be on the left menu bar. And you're also going to see a list of all the iTunes backup files on your screen. And so just go ahead and select the file that you want to use to restore the deleted WhatsApp messages. And finally, from there, go ahead and press start scan. And then you're going to see a list of all of the scan messages on your screen. So just go through these results and then choose the conversations that you want to restore and then press the restore to device button and the tool will just automatically restore them on your iDevice from there. So that's how you can use Dr. Phone Data Recovery as you restore all of your deleted WhatsApp chats on different smartphones in different situations. So no doubt losing important WhatsApp conversations can look like a nightmare for anyone at first. But thanks to Dr. Phone Data Recovery, you can get them back within just a few minutes regardless of the smartphone that you are currently using. So if you were able to get back the deleted WhatsApp conversations as well, do make sure to drop a like on the video if this tutorial ended up helping you. Also, if you face any kind of issues while using this tool, do make sure to let us know in the comment section and we will get back to you as soon as possible. And to see more updates just like this in the future, go ahead and click on the subscribe button along with tacking that notification bell, which will help us out quite a lot. So with that said, this has been Francisco from Wondershare Doctor Phone. Thank you for watching and until next time, have a great day.